Hello everyone, how are you all? Everyone fine? I am also doing super. Finally, CA final exam for group 1 for May 2023 attempt is over. And I hope every student have written best in their exam. My best wishes will be always with you all for the exam result. But now can I say we need to shift our focus from May 2023 exam to November 2023 exam? It means now our, our duty will be started for those students who will be writing the exam in November 2023 attempt. Can I say normally a student who will be writing for the first time in November 2023 exam, they will get a leave period of 5 months for both group. Correct? So one prime question will arise, ki, sir, how to revise FR paper in the last 5 months. So in this video, I am taking one assumption that you normally a student will get a leave period of 5 months and you are going to revise from the month of June. From the month of June. This video is recorded in the month of May, but I am taking one assumption that your revision period will start from the month of June. It is quite possible that you may get a leave period of 6 months. It is quite possible that you may get a leave period of 4 months. Then you need to adjust accordingly whatever I am discussing 5 months for 6 months and 4 months. Correct? Understood? So can we start a discussion? But before I start a discussion, don't forget to subscribe the channel and like and share the video. Now, what are the questions which will come in the mind of a student before starting the revision? Correct? Let us first highlight the question which will come in the mind of a student before they start the revision. What are the questions? First question, sir, which books will follow for FR preparation? First question you have understood. Second question, sir, how many times we should revise FR before last revision? Before last revision. Third question, sir, whether you will provide any revision lecture from which we can do revision because we have taken FR classes some year before and we have forgotten all the concept so some revision lecture will you provide this is the third question fourth question what will be the order of chapter in which we should revise normally what happened student don't know from which chapter they should revise suppose they started revision from consolidation chapter but consolidation chapter require attention of many other India so if you revise if you start your revision from consolidation chapter it is quite possible that there are some link with the other chapter and you will be wasting your time. So I need to give you the order of the chapter in which you should revise. These are the questions from my point of view for which you re require answer. So I will be discussing all the questions series wise. Understood? Got it? Now let us start with the first question. Ki, sir, which book we should follow for FR preparation? Now whenever I say about book, so only you should concentrate on ICR resource. When I say ICR resource, it means ICR study material, RTP, MTP till date and all the exam question till date. Correct? Now coming to coming to my student point to be already I have provided you two volumes of India Science book and four volume of question bank. Correct? Now first let us let us speak about India Sarans book. The last edition of my India Sarans book was third edition. Correct? And there is no major amendment in the third edition for November 2023 attempt. For May 2023, there were few amendments. And for that, already I have uploaded a video in YouTube so that you can refer that. Correct? And for November 2023, if there is any amendment, I'll be going to come soon for that amendment. Understood means I'll be recording a video for that. So don't worry about amendment till amendment right now for preparation means don't postpone your preparation because of amendment because there are very few amendment which you can refer after revision also correct yes sir now just i just want to inform that i am just going to soon launch my fourth edition of what india sana's book but there is no major changes from third edition to fourth edition so you can follow the third edition india sana's book coming to question bank can i say question bank i am I have already released the ninth edition of question bank and ninth edition of question bank will be having all the questions of ICS study matter, RTP, MTP till November till, till May 2023 exam and all the exam question till November 2022 exam. So it is quite possible that you have already purchased or you have taken classes then you have received some previous edition. So don't worry about that. I will be giving a link from which you can download all the additional questions which I have incorporated in 8th edition and night edition or any previous edition don't worry and if you want to purchase my recent edition means night edition you can buy it from the website correct so i will sell follow the follow the latest question bank 
let us question bank for the FR preparation understood because any new question whatever has been added by ICI is always important from exam point of view correct now you can also follow any faculty books any other faculty books provided can I say provided it contains all the questions of ICI resource correct but I will just say that if you are following my book don't worry you can follow that got it yes sir correct so can you see this question you have understood all the points now coming to the next question sir how many times FR papers should be revised before last revision so from my point of view before last revision you should revise two times every subject in the last five months for this purpose what we will do will divide entire five months into three part first part consisting of three months that is 90 days second part consisting of the next 50 days and third part consisting of the last 10 days correct now coming to the last part of 10 days it is for last revision so that is not counted for this discussion correct now second part consisting of 50 de 50 days it is for second revision of all the subject of both the group correct now what i will do i will come with a new video for the how to revise the second revision in the next two months means after completion of three months the last two months how to revise the second revision for that i will create a new video after completion of three months understood though in this video what i will do i will concentrate on first revision only understood yes sir now coming to the first part that is of 90 days 90 days means three months can we say 90 days divide by eight paper effectively it will come 11 point something days correct means for each subject you have 11 days but from my point of view there are two subjects fr and dt which is very vast for revision purpose so we should allocate more number of hours for fr and dt so what i have done from my experience point of view that fr minimum 15 days are required minimum 15 days is required sir how to do this can I say there are many other paper for example law audit and elective paper or idt which may take less than 11 days which may take less than 11 days correct now now how to plan that subject you can decide by your own but from my point of view for fr minimum 15 days is required so you need to allocate minimum 15 days for fr for first revision understood means you can give more than 15 days but you can't give less than 15 days for first revision now each day you should revise 12 hours per day so 15 in 12 it will be effectively 180 hours means minimum 180 hour is required for the first revision once again i will say you can give more than 180 hours but you can't give less than 180 hours for the first time revision of fr understood now one question may arise sir how to revise means how to study 12 hours per day can i say in one day there is 12, 24 hours and out of 24 hours i am just asking 50 percent of time should be given to what study can i say this will be your last exam last exam of, of your life so can you for last exam of your life can you give more hours to study yes sir we can give so 12 hours will be allocated per day what you can do you can divide entire day into four part four part means first part second part third part and fourth part consisting of three hours that you decide how to do that correct now now you need to create four part and accordingly you need to plan your study accordingly you need to plan your study so once again what i want to say for first revision of fr minimum 15 days each day 12 hours minimum is required means minimum 180 hour is required for revision purpose understood correct coming to the second second revision second revision means the second part of 50 days what i have done i have allocated eight days one second of 12 hours to so eight days into 12 hours effectively it will come 100 hours so 100 hours will be required for second revision but can you see you can revise 100 hours effectively in second revision once you have planned your first revision perfectly understood so second revision can be done effectively once you have planned your first revision perfectly that you need to understand therefore right now we are focusing on first revision so once again what i want to say he for first revision you need to do uh, fr preparation effectively for making it effective 15 days will be required and for 15 days 180 hours you need to what allocate now one question may arise sir how to revise whether we should do single subject per day or we should give so we should do two subjects per day or more than two subjects from my point of view if you ask my suggestion so i will suggest one subject one day means first uh, take fr or any other subject means you can start with sfm you can start with any other subject correct now because right now i am discussing about fr so i if suppose you start with fr so you start with fr complete it within 15 days and then you start a new subject alternatively what you can do 
what you can do you can take two subject per day per day one is theory subject one is practical subject with fi you can take law and audit law or audit i will say so suppose law you have taken and for law you have given what four hours of five hours to balance number of hours you have given for what fr so of course your number of days for fr preparation will increase that you need to plan accordingly correct so i have just given the number of hours based on number of hours you need to what you need to find out a number of days understood so this question i hope you have understood got it now what is the next question let us come to the next question next question is that sir whether you will provide any revision lecture for november 20 november 2023 exam so what i just want to inform you that already i have uploaded marathon lecture for may 2023 and november 2023 attempt and that video is also applicable for november 2023 exam so what you can do that before revising any chapters you can refer that video for your revision purpose and believe me that revision video will help you to understand a concept very clearly it is quite possible that you have taken classes few year before so you have forgotten the entire concept now what what will happen if you revise by your own it might happen you are taking more time so for that purpose what i am saying that first you listen my revision lecture for that particular chapter then do all the questions by your own correct let me take one example suppose you have allocated 25 hours for financial instrument chapter correct now so my marathon lectures is of 5 hours for financial instrument chapter so first you listen that marathon lecture for financial instrument chapter in that lecture i have taken many questions also so that question is also covered now once you have understood the entire concept once you have understood you once you have done all the questions whatever whatever i have done in the marathon lecture now the balanced question can i say you can do by your own in that way you can i say you can minimize the number of time number of hours for the revision and believe me this will help you believe me this will help you understood correct now sir whether you will take any live online classes because we are not comfortable in recorded classes so right now i'll be not taking any live online classes for marathon or revision lecture because of my hectic schedule but of course after after may 2023 exam result i'll be taking one live online revision lecture that will be around in the month of september correct now so that will help you in second revision so of course right now i'll be not taking any live online revision lecture but i'll be coming soon for the second revision for live online revision lecture that will help you what for the second revision but for the first revision i will suggest you that you can revise from marathon lecture and believe me it is going to help you a lot correct understood correct this question is also over now what is the next question sir in which order we should start fr preparation keep from which chapter we should start our preparation normally what happen is student don't know from which chapter they should start and therefore they waste a lot of time correct now for this purpose what i have done i have divided entire fr syllabus into eight part let us start with the part one part one consists of all the indias related with assets and liability therefore you should start your preparation with only these indias correct now these indias will consist of indias 2 indias 16 indias 38 indias 40 indias 23 indias 12 indias 36 then liability is 37 30 uh, india's 10 and then agriculture india's 41 so first you should start your fr preparation from this chapter these are small chapter this will give you a confidence for the first time revision normally a student follow abc category for the first revision normally they will start with the consolidation can is consolidation a big chapter and if you are not able to get that chapter in the first instance only it will it will make your moral down understood therefore we should not give abc category analysis for fr preparation for the first time abc category analysis will be used for the second revision understood correct now now this indias related to assets and liability normally from these a uh, question of 15 20 marks will come the so important chapter only and for this part one chapter i have allocated 25 to 30 hours so in that way you can also decide ki how many hours you should give for part one chapters the so 25 minimum hours and 30 maximum hours you should give for this particular chapters part two then you should start with two chapters that is india's 19 and india's 102 that is related to employee benefit correct now so india's 19 and india's 102 weightage of from this chapter will be 5 to 10 marks and you should give how many hours for the revision of this chapter 15 to 17 hours i have allocated to this chapter correct 
तो सेकेंड पार्ट यू अंडरस्टूड देन आफ्टर कंप्लीशन ऑफ सेकेंड पार्ट यू शुड मूव टू फाइनेंशियल इंस्ट्रूमेंट चैप्टर करेक्ट ना मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट चैप्टर आई विल से पार्ट थ्री फाइनेंशियल इंस्ट्रूमेंट चैप्टर द वेटेज ऑफ दिस चैप्टर विल बी ट्वेंटी फाइव टू ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव मार्क्स वेटेज विल बी देयर एंड आई हैव गिवन हाउ मेनी आवर्स आई हैव गिवन ट्वेंटी फाइव टू थर्टी आवर्स आई हैव गिवन फॉर फाइनेंशियल इंस्ट्रूमेंट चैप्टर वंस यू हैव कवर्ड विद फाइनेंशियल इंस्ट्रूमेंट चैप्टर देन विल मूव टू पार्ट फोर पार्ट फोर कंसिस्ट ऑफ इंडियाज रिलेटेड टू इनकम स्टेटमेंट इन दिस देर विल बी थ्री इंडियाज वन इज इंडियाज वन वन फाइव रेवेन्यू देन इंडियाज वन वन सिक्स लीज एंड देन इंडियाज ट्वेल्व इनकम टैक्स द वेटेज फ्रॉम दिस चैप्टर विल फिफ्टीन ट्वेंटी मार्क्स एंड How many hours I have allocated? I have allocated 25 to 20 hours, 28 hours for these particular chapters. Correct now. After completion of part four, we'll move to part five, which will be nothing but uh, Miss Group Accounting Consolidation and Business Combination chapter. So part five will consist of business combination chapters and consolidation chapter. Consolidation chapter will be consisting of what? India's 110, India's 28, India's 111, India's 27. Correct now. Business combination means India's 10. Three. The weightage from this chapter will be 20-25 marks and number of hours I have allocated 50 hours for these two chapters. So maximum hours I have given correct yes sir. Then part six. Uh, Part six will move to what India's with general purpose financial statement means it will consist of India's 101, India's 1, India's 7, India's 34, and India's 8 and India's 1. The small small chapters correct now. Small small chapter weightage will be 10 to 15 marks. Question may come from this chapter and number of hours I have given to these small chapters what 15 hours I have given correct yes sir. Then part seven consists of other India's whatever India's are left for example India's 21, India's 1. 105, India's 24, India's 33, and India's 108. These are also small, small chapter for these small, small chapters. I have given how many hours? 15 hours. I have given, and the weightage from this chapter may means marks may come. What? How many marks question come? Can come 10 marks question may be asked from this chapter. The last part will be miscellaneous chapter. Miss whatever left in miscellaneous chapter, there will be normally four chapter. One will be analysis of financial st statement chapter. Correct now. Then conceptual framework theoretical chapter. Then integrated reporting theoretical chapter and CSR reporting. CSR reporting. So these four chapter will come into miscellaneous topic. Last topic. Correct now. Last topic. So I have given 10 hours for these chapters. Correct now. And this may consist of 10 to 50 marks. Normally from analysis of financial statement question may come from 10 marks for 10 marks and conceptual framework integrated reporting normally they ask the theory question of the six marks correct now so this become the entire weightage and also how many hours should be given chapter wise or part wise we can say understood correct so in this way you can start your revision and complete your revision in 180 hours for first time revision understood i will i hope this whatever video i am creating this will help you for your first revision got it now there are some special tips which i also like to discuss with you correct but up to this have you understood now let us discuss some special tips for the first revision so what i want to give for first revision that in first revision all the ICI study material question, RTP question, MTP questions should be done. Correct now. In first revision, you should cover all the questions of ICI resource. Correct now. Already question bank, it is compiled. So from that, you can revise all the questions of ICI resource. Correct. Second, while doing revision means while doing revision some question need to be revised by writing means you are not supposed to see the solution for all the question means there are some question for which revision should be done by writing because that will that will increase your speed and that will increase your writing speed understood now now what i should say, say that for example in one chapter there are 50 question out of 50 question can i say there are some question which are very important and that is already highlighted during the class that question you can do by writing other question you can read the solution only correct now so some questions you need to point out and that question you need to revise by writing because that will help you in increasing your speed and understanding what mistakes you are committed what mistake you are committing while doing the solutions understood correct now while doing revision what you should do all the questions you should divide into three category there are some questions which can be understood easily without without referring the solution so this question you are not supposed to revise in second time revision correct now means these are the question where second revision is not required some question 
what happened you have understood but you need to refer the solution for some special point that is special point whatever where you have done mistake or which you have not understood by your own that should be written somewhere and that question need to be revised again second time in second revision understood so that you need to mark as yes you need to revise second time in second revision and the last question of which type which you have not understood by your own for which entire solution you to refer this become must revise question before exam means in second revision also you should revise and of course before last revision means during last revision also you should revise this type of question so during first time revision you should plan second revision also ki how to minimize the time of second revision can i say in this way only you can minimize because in second revision you are not supposed to do all the question of ici resource So during first time revision, what you should do out of all the question, you should select, you should find out which question is require revision, which question will require revision in second revision. Understood? Yes, sir. Now next tip is what mark all the mistake means whatever mistakes you are committing while doing or while practicing the question that you should write down in a piece of paper in a separate notebook. Can I say this will also help you in second revision? Correct, and you can revise again and again whatever mistakes you are doing. Correct, so that you write down somewhere. Whatever mistakes you are committing, write down somewhere uh, in a piece of paper in a separate notebook. Correct, yes, sir. Then whatever doubt is coming in your mind, for example, in the first slot of three hours, you are doing one chapter, and there are two three doubts came. So I will say, don't ask the doubt with your friends or with your respective faculties, means from me immediately. You should write down that doubt somewhere and up. <coughs> sorry after completion of 3 hours what happened then just take your mobile ask the doubt in telegram group i will respond immediately whenever there is a time correct now so that doubt should be written somewhere again separately and whenever you have time free time mean relaxation time that time you can ask the doubt from your respective faculties don't worry whatever doubt you are asking you 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 are asking in telegram group i am bound to answer that correct so if your my student already have given one dedicated telegram group for what my student and if you are not my student you can ask out in the telegram group for which the link will be given in the description of this video understood this point last point don't keep your mobile with you while you are doing revision i will say this is, mobile is a totally destruction of your life it will of course distract if you destroy we are say correct now so don't keep mobile with you while you are doing revision just keep give your mobile to your parents so that after 3 hours one slot is over then go and touch your mobile before that you are not supposed to touch your mobile during the revision time these are some special tips which i just want to give you which will help you during your revision which will help you during revision got it this much you have understood i hope this will help you for your first revision and also to plan your second revision effectively correct but now one question arises sir what about those student who have not taken classes till now for november 2023 attempt for fr or any other subject correct now and what about those student who is who will be writing their who will be writing their group 2 ca inter exam but their ca final exam will be due in november 2023 attempt there may be such case also correct now for them what we are planning we are planning we have already announced a face to face class in hyderabad and live online batch for the group 1 entire subject which will be commencing from 7th of june which will be commencing from 7th of june and the duration of batch will be 3 month can i say in this 3 month you can complete the entire subject under one roof correct or any other subject if you want to take only fr or only sfm only law or only audit that also you can take means will be providing all subject in one roof if you want to take all subject and you can complete the entire subject in 3 month correct now so we will plan the classes as well as revision for you in this 3 month so that in the next 2 month you can prepare and you can write down the exam correct now who will be the faculty of course can i say in this the faculty will be the eminent faculty from the industry fr will be taken by me as of course sfm will be taken by very good faculty renowned faculty ca mohit jain sir i hope you all know about him nothing to say about him then audit will be taken by very good faculty from visakhapatnam ca ravi karan valla is a very good faculty young faculty who will be taking your audit subject and the law will be taken one second by very good faculty very eminent faculty of the industry ca gautam jain sir everyone knows him correct now so this 
four subjects will be taken by four good faculty under one roof so you can join if you have not taken any subject or if you are planning to take entire subject you can join this correct now so this will be what uh, group one all subject face to face class in Hyderabad as well as will provide live online classes what which you can listen from your home only correct now you can join this what I will do I will make a separate video for subject wide which will help you that what we are going to deal in this subject separately correct now understood this much you have understood uh, any details means whatever details you want for this subject or this batch you can contact the number given or whatever correct now number given you can write on the number if you want to write on 8766246684 so you can contact this number for any further detail about the batch thank you very much i hope whatever i have discussed you have understood and this will help you bye bye take care all the best for your november 2023 exam bye bye love you all bye bye